Finally today in Altoona, Pennsylvania, there's a young man on a mission to spread joy, doing it in a box. Maggie Smolka explains. Typing away and sorting merchandise at Bentwookie Comics in Johnstown. This is a second home for me. William Dill knows how to keep a low profile. That is until he suits up in his cardboard costume. My signature is usually the wave. And hits the streets with smiles and waves. It's always a nice little boost whenever I hear people, you know, they're like, hey, box boy, yeah. On a busy afternoon, cars and people pass by. <laughs> they send a few beeps at the local guy known as box boy. People seem to really like it. They, they get really excited when they see the box boy and they they park and take pictures with me. His 10-year-old self would be proud. Yeah, overall, it's just a good time. What started out of boredom grew into something much bigger. When I started, I thought I would probably just do it for a few weeks, uh, see you know, how many laughs I get, and that would be it. But uh, it kind of stuck with people. Oh, yeah. Yeah, sometimes they get really excited. More than a decade later. I just kept, kept it going. I'm 23 now, so I've been doing it for 13 years. The joy he brings to others keeps him going. I'm just kind of a, like a local superhero to some people. Discount Iron Man. A superhero of sorts. Sort of like a town superhero that doesn't have any powers. But don't let him fool you. Yeah, did you hear that? All his power lies in the laughs and entertainment he brings to the community. People are like, uh, you know what I just saw on the way to work here? Uh, just saw the box boy. I didn't even know he actually existed. I thought people were lying to me. Hey, look, it's box boy. It can be easy to get lost in the hustle and bustle of life. <laughs> But Box Boy shows us all to look around at our surroundings and just smile. Yeah, people see something wacky, they're gonna they're gonna have a smile put on their face. You know, they're gonna be like, what the heck was that? A reminder that sometimes you can take the simplest things. Cardboard and tape. And make people feel like a million bucks.